Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Switch, and I'm here today reviewing Apple. And what an amazing move the stock had today. In fact, the low of the day was 155.26, and Apple still looks lower. Really like this gap today. Uh, rated well. Perfect, perfect, perfect entry in Apple right in here. I called it. Boom, dropped like a brick. So they could have taken it here and got out. Beautiful move. Do, 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 do. That's what you like to see. It had one more push. One more push if you held it. So again, ideally, if you're getting in the stock, you're trying to get a dollar close to it. And something like this, definitely, you could have gotten even a bigger move in it if you had it had held it all the way down. But you know, warning time, target, going for the day. Really love the stock out in the morning, but to be honest with you, Apple looks lower, and it looks like it's going to hold the red today and drop some more. So you can watch it. Really nice trade shaping up to be a good week. Earnings season is here. Although this was not an earnings gap, it was a news gap today in Apple. So there is stocks gap for many, many reasons. News, reports, can gap with the market, the sector, all kinds of things. But I felt that there would be selling action and shorting action today in Apple, and that is what occurred. So congratulations to everyone who did Apple and made money today. Nice day. And tomorrow's Friday. See what we get. If you're interested in the Golden Gap course, if you want to sign up and learn how to day trade, and specifically if you want to learn how to find good stocks to short, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Have a great day, everyone.